Welcome to Knot Wars, where we pit fishing's best knots in a head-to-head -head competition to determine which knots you can count on. And while the focus will be on knots that work best with monofilament, we're going to provide test results for fluorocarbons and super lines as well. Our test lines include 14-pound Triline XT Tough Red Monofilament, 14-pound Fireline in Flame Green, and the new 100% fluorocarbon trialing in 15 pound test. We had a real street brawl last week with the Duncan Loop Knot taking on the Eye Crosser Knot, the knot with the coolest name. The winner, the Eye Crosser, but it went right down to the wire. If you missed last week's show, here's how you tie the Eye Crosser. The first step is to take the line and run it through the hook eye twice. Then bring about eight inches up the main line, go parallel, fold it back toward the hook, and then take the tag in and run around the parallel lines once, twice, and then with all knots, moisten with some saliva and pull tight. Now that's the eye crosser knot and it's done very well the last couple weeks, but we're bringing in a very, very tough competitor. In fact, it's my favorite knot. It's called the Palomar. And here's how you tie it. To start the Palomar, double the main line and run it through the hook eye. Then double the loop back and make an overhand knot around the standing line, leaving the loop large enough for the hook or lure to pass through. Put the entire hook or lure through the loop, and as with all knots, moisten with a little saliva and draw tight. Now that's the Palomar, and it's my favorite knot, at least it has been over the years, because it's super strong and it's really easy to tie. In fact, you can tie it at night with your eyes closed if you had to. But is it the strongest knot? Well, this is a test I've been looking forward to for a long time. Let's see if it can beat the eye crosser. Now I've already got our trusty knot machine set up with our two-time champ, the eye crosser on the right. On the left is my perennial favorite, the Palomar. Now it's up to the machine to tell us which knot is best. Wow, look at this, we're up to 20. Did you see that? That's incredible. These are great results, 20.9. The eye crosser broke just before the Palomar. You know, over multiple tests, we're finding that both of these knots are testing at about 100% of the line test. That means they're great choices for mono. However, I'm gonna have to give the nod to the Palomar because it performed consistently better with fluorocarbon and much, much better with Fireline. In fact, with Fireline, it's the only knot we've tested to date that I would recommend. Well, it wasn't pretty, but the Palomar did come out on top of the eye crosser, so it advances to next week, where it faces a real tough challenger in the tri lean knot. Don't miss it. Also, if you want to practice these knots at home, go to fishingclub.com. We have all the instructions right there for you. Knot wars, because no good fishtail ends with a broken knot.